Welcome to one and all. This is class 10. Parabola graph tabulation in the easy way. In the previous video itself, I have explained how to do the tabulation. Here, we are going to see the actual tabulation for the given problem. 2x square minus 3x minus 5. Here, first one is 2x square. That means that we have to multiply x two times and then again it is multiplied by 2. The thing is, first we have to find out square value of x. Then we have to multiply by 2. Here x value is minus 5, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here, first I am going to find out x square. There is nothing but 5 into 5. Minus 5 into minus 5 equal to 25. Minus 4 into minus 4 equal to 16. Minus 3 into minus 3 equal to plus 9. Next thing is minus 2 into minus 2 is nothing but plus 4. A minus 1 into minus 1 that is nothing but plus 1. 0 into 0 equal to 0. That's a 0 is multiplied by 0. Then we get a 0. Then 1 into 1 equal to 1. 2 equal to 2 into 2 equal to 4. 3 into 3 equal to 9. 4 into 4 equal to 16. Then the last one is 5 square. That is nothing but 5 into 5 equal to 25. The thing is, I am going to find out 2x square. That is nothing but 2 into 25 equal to 15. That's 25 plus 25 equal to 50. That's another way. 16 into 2 equal to 32. And then 9 into 2 equal to 18. And then 4 into 2 equal to 8. And then 1 into 2 equal to 2. And then 0 into 2 equal to 0. And that's 1 into 2 equal to 2. Then 4 into 2 equal to 8, the same thing is repeated. 9 into 2 equal to 18. 16 into 2 equal to 32. Then 5 in, Then 25 into 2 equal to 50. That's the last one. In the column. Next one is mid one that is nothing but minus 3x that means that 3 table then 3 table is minus 5 into minus 3 equal to 15 because eyebrows you have to remember that eyebrows strategy that's a left eyebrow is minus right eyebrow is minus then nose is your plus minus into minus plus then 5 3s are 15, 4 3s are 12, 3 3s are 9, 2 3s are minus 2 into minus 3 equal to 6. Then 1 minus 1 into minus 3 equal to plus 3. Then 0 into 3 equal to 0. Then it is nothing but after the 0, we have that only positive number. Positive number is multiplied with minus 3. So, we get all the minus after 0. Minus 1 into, sorry, minus 3 into 1 equal to minus 3. Mi minus 3 into 2 equal to minus 6. Minus 3 into plus 3 minus 9. Minus 3 into 4 equal to minus 12. Minus 3 into 5 equal to minus 15. That's why I have 
retaining the red color. Next thing is for minus 5, that's a constant that is lost one is constant wherever uh, the column is there we have to put uh, as a minus 5 invariably whatever may be the value of x we have to put minus 5 invariably whatever may be the value of x then we have here, here i am putting the uh, minus 5 in each and every column of that minus 5 row yes that's a constant row that's called as a constant row that's why i am putting that minus 5 in each of the column of that particular constant row it's a very very interesting thing and as well as easy one or minus that's why I use the numbers in the color of red and next row is very important one this a three row is taken into account 2x square minus 3x minus 5 this three rows is taken into account then I have to put the plus number alone in that in the in this row this is a 50 plus 15 equal to 65 and then 32 plus 12 equal equal to 44 and then 18 plus 9 equal to 27 and then 8 plus 6 equal to 14 and then next next column is 2 plus 3 equal to 5 the next column is 0 plus 0 that's all the pluses are taken in the column of 2x square minus 3x minus 5 rows then 0 plus 0 equal to 0. Then the 1th column, that's a only plus is 2. Then 2 is put there. And then 2nd column, the only plus is 8. And then in the 3rd column, the only plus is 18. Then it will put there. And then the 4th column, the only plus is 32. Then in the fifth column, last one column, uh, 50 is the only plus that is put there. The next one is minus column. It's very, very important. All the minus added and put here. Then uh, from that above three columns, 2x squared minus 3x minus 5. In that term, First one is minus 5 column, there is only a minus 5. And then minus 4 column, there is only a minus 5. Minus 3 column, there is only a minus 5. In the minus 2 column, there will be only minus 5. Then it is put there. Then in the 0th column, there should be a only 1 minus 5. Then it should be put there. In the first column, here, 2 minus is added together minus 5 minus 3 that is equal to minus 8 and then in the, in the third column is we are going to find out for y y equal to 2x square minus 3x minus 5 is given in the problem that is nothing but y here in this plus or plus and minus we have to subtract from plus to minus okay in this two column i have to, to do that operation here 65 minus 5 is nothing but 60 44 minus 5 equal to 39 27 minus 5 equal to 22 4 in the next value for minus 2 x value for the minus 2 x value 14 minus 5 equal to 9 n for the x value minus 1 5 minus 5 equal to 0 this 0 touches the x axis at one time then it gives them equal equal solution then it is nothing but equal solution then minus 1 is the root of the equation above equation then 0 in the 0 column 0 minus 5 
that is nothing but minus 5. In the first column, 8 minus 2. Here, minus 8. That is a big number. Then 8 minus 2 is nothing but 6. That is minus 6. In the second column, 11 minus 11 plus 8. That is nothing but minus 3 because 11 is the big number. The minus is the big number. Then we get the minus 3. Then the third column, 18 minus 14, we get 4. In the fourth column, for the value of x equal to 4, 32 minus 17 equal to 15. Then in the fifth column, 15 minus 20 equal to 30. I think that this will enable uh, children uh, to do easy way without making any any mistakes okay that's quite interesting then here i wanted to do the tabulation for x and y again for x and y alone sorry again it's not again it's x and y alone because i i'm going to plant the points in the graph for that i'm going to tablet x for the corresponding x value what is the y value here for the x value minus 5 minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 0 1 2 3 4 5 and 5 lost 25 for the corresponding y values for the minus 5 minus 5 for the minus 5 y value is 60 then for the corresponding x value minus 4 y value is 39 then the corresponding for the x value equal to minus 3 then its value is Twenty two, then for the corresponding um, x equal to minus two, y value is nine. For the corresponding uh, minus one for the x value is y value is zero. Because y values happen to be a zero, only one zero here, then it gives the equal solutions because it touches the x axis at one time. This minus 1 is the root of the equation. Then for the corresponding x value 0, y value is minus 5. For the corresponding x value is 1, in y value is minus 6. For the next thing is, for the corresponding x value is 2, y value is minus 3. Then for the corresponding x value is 3, y value is 4. Then, Next thing is for the corresponding x value is 4, then corresponding y value is 15. Then the last one is for the corresponding x value is 5, y value is 30. Then uh, we are going to plot the points in the xy graph. For that, minus 5 here the points are minus 5 comma 60 minus 4 comma 39 minus 3 comma 22 minus 2 comma 9 minus 1 comma 0 0 comma minus 5 1 comma minus 6 2 comma minus 3 3 comma 4 and then 4 comma 15 and then 5 comma 30 in this uh, x-y graph we are going to plot this point